welcome back to Legend of Zelda the Wii So last time we got our we got our sale and we free uh Tingo. That was rested, I guess. Oh, I'm sorry, did you do your strike at the end, uh brother? Oh, nice. Beautiful. Stretch. Anyway, today we're in Dragon Root. I so, um, the Red Lion mentioned about the, uh, I guess the Den Pearl that he just mentioned. So we're gonna, I guess we're gonna investigate, um, uh, Dragon Root. See what we can find. And also, we got the Wind Waker, of course. We don't, we don't, we're not gonna use it right at the moment. So we're just gonna go ahead and, uh, what's that up there? Hold on. There's a chest up there. But I don't have anything to shoot it down. I guess we'll have to do that later, I guess. So we don't have any arrows, that's the part I would. Hmm. Oh yeah, these rocks and these mines right here, that's one of them on our way. To, um, I drop it this. The bird managed to throw us out from the Forsaken Fortress. And then the King Lion, which is the boat, kind of saved us. So yeah, we're okay. Thanks for your concern. I must say, you travel far from one with no wings. Well... Yeah, of course. And your sister? Is she... Don't worry. I believe I believe she's fine, but we saw her. But then the bird, you know, took two Link. Away. From his sister. Is that so? Well, don't worry too much. I'm sure she'll hang in there. I have an idea. Would you like to meet our chief then? I told my people here about you, and all of us retailers are very concerned. I'm concerned that Chitan will be will be friending you and lead you lead you to aid of our experts. It's said on them. I'll fly on ahead and let everyone know we are coming. Come inside. 
Or come inside to me. I'll be waiting. Alright. Let's go. We won't talk. Let's go. Yeah, I don't have time to do all this little shenanigan breaking joints and shit. Okay, that must be the elder. Well, have you discovered the cause of great love and anger? Ah, so you are Tony, are you? Quill has told me of you. Quill has told me all about you. A trouble in tale indeed. I insist that you let us know if there is anything we can do to help you. We shall do anything in our power to assist you. However, in the meantime, we have a problem of our own to deal with. What kind of, pro what kind of problem? <laughs> when you arrived on the island, did you notice the ranged dragon and person? I'm curious on the top of the mountain. Now you mention it. That dragon? Yeah, it, it did. It really did. And you can see, we... We are the... We to... Dragons? I don't know if I said it right. Uh, dragons. Are profoundly connected to the sky. We make our living. In the airways. We do so by the grace of the sky spirit of Owl. When Ritos reach, reaches uh, adulthood, he or she journeys to the top of the dragon room to receive a scale from the great dragon. It is this scale that enables Ritos to grow his wings or his or her wings. Well, is that true? I really want to know. I mean, I did play it on the GameCube version. I'm like, wait, what? Wings? That's something. Recently, rank, recently, however, the, the once gently battle has grown violent and, un, and unpredictable. Sadly, we can't no longer approach him. If this continues, the, the fleeting who are more on the age will never be able to receive scales from Mellow on Dragon Ring. Wow. I feel bad for these guys. They will remain wingless. In the time, our very, our very way of life will be threatened. That sounds scary. As she did of the Beatles, my fellow responsibility is to solve this problem. My first. First responsibility. <laughs> My apologies, but I must ask you to wait for our assistance until this is done. Will you do so? <laughs> the look of his face. <laughs> so he'll he'll do it. He'll wait. She said, what do you think of what do you think of consult consulting uh, to him with regards to your son? Prince come on. Man. Whatever his name is I can't pronounce his name. As you can see, Tulik is a gently young lad. I feel like something that Prince Komel will open his heart to him and speak freely of his fears and worries. That might be. He just whispered, talking to himself. <laughs> Let me be direct, my son. I don't know if I said his name right, Kamel, Kamil, Kamali, or something like that. His age is, <laughs> is of the age to learn, to earn his wings. Come on. Yeah. Yet he is weak in some ways. And in the light of the current situation, he may, he may just give up on, he didn't. Sorry. He may just give up, give up on ever getting them. I mean, my room is terrible. 
What's that, you? Will you share some of your courage with my son? Will you meet with my son? Sure, I guess. I thank you. We shall do our best to solve our problem as quickly as possible. So that we may... So that we may better help help you with, with yours. I have something I wish to give you to give to my son. A young girl named Mandel? Manly? No, it's Manly. I said it right. Man, Manly. It's holding it's holding it for me. Will you find will you find her and take it? Will you find her and take it? I am counting on you. Here, tell me to take this with you. Who knows? It might come in handy. Oh, we got a delivery bag. That's very helpful as well. You we should find Melly in one in the uh, upper rooms. Leave the great Valo bottles to us. In the meanwhile, do your best to aid Prince. Komali. <sighs> Komali. I don't know if I said it right. Komali. Prince Kamali, yeah, that's his name. So they were talking about um, <clears throat> the dragon that we just saw just now. Pretty much in a bad shape, like in a dark shape, or something like that. Okay, we gotta find this. Oh, there she is. Wow, you really do have green clothes and a strange shape, shape hat. You're the tree, aren't you? Yep, that's me. Oh, me, I am attendant to the great sky spirit of Bible. My name is Melly. So you're Melly, huh? Interesting. Well, to tell you the truth, I'm not attendant quite yet. I'm actually still studying to be one. Oh, what am I thinking? Oh, what am I thinking? Here, this is from the chief chieftain. Tony, he he wants you to get this threatened to Prince Kamala. Oh, it's a letter. Nice. The room the room weighs in the back the room way in the back. On the first floor is Prince Kamali room. You have to go down a couple steps to get there. When you meet the Prince Kamali, please don't go. Please don't get offended by these matters. He has no bad intention. Inten intention? I promise. By the way, um, listen to me. I have a small favor I'd like to ask of you. Will you please come to the entry of the Dragon Room Cavalry later? I will explain everything then. Uh... Okay, I suppose? <laughs> Alright, let's go look for the prince. She said it's down below. Oh, it's this way. Right here. Down the steps. There he is. Is that? Yeah, that's a tin pearl. Or a ball. Yeah, that's a pearl that he's holding. Huh? Who are you supposed to be? for me and I don't want to talk to anyone right now. Well, damn, I'd be rude. Alright, I guess we're going to have to go ahead and show them the letter. So let's do that right now. A letter from my father? Oh, sure. Tell me... 
telling me to be brave is easy enough for him. If it's not like it's not like he's the one who went through a horrible experience. And it's not like he's it's not like he still had to go get a scale from Bellum. You're in, you're in this letter too, you know. Poking your nose in other people's business. You're nosy, aren't you? Sorry. I really don't feel like... I really don't feel like going to see Val right now. I mean, how am I supposed to get a scale from him when he is so upset? What? Are you trying to say that you can calm Val down? <laughs> That's just a big fat lie. It's easy to say you can do anything. Bragging doesn't cost a thing. I tell you what, if you can find me some, if you can find <laughs> me someone who can get past all the obstacles on Dragon Room to get to get to uh, Valo, then I'll listen. Then I'll listen to anything you say. So. What? Oh, this? It's strange holding this con holding this this It's strange holding this calms me down. I forget all the bad things. It's so pretty, isn't it? It's called Den's Pearl. My grandma gave this to me. My grandma used to be about a, a ten. She was the only person on the island who understood my language. My grandma, she was here. I know she can come and bottle down. I just know. My father and the rest, no matter how hard they try, they fail. I know it. No one else can come and bottle it down. It's impossible. <laughs> what? What is it, huh? Listen, you can stay all you want, but I'm not giving this to you. This is my treasure, you understand? I'm not I'm not going to just hand it over to some to some do nothing guy, am I? Okay, <laughs> that's pretty odd. Anyway, let's just get out of here. <laughs> yeah, he said uh, if we calm down that dragon he will listen. And that's what we're gonna do right now. So I advise you to behave and show some respect, kid. Imagine my brother would do anything for you to calm that dragon down, you know? I don't care. What? Anyway, uh. Wait, wait. What's this? I've seen your young face before. Nope, don't believe so. Hmm? Oh, wait, I think I remember this part where you do a little mini game. Depending on how many uh, mails you uh, put in, but you gotta match the seal as possible. Seven. 
I guess we can do it again. Now we gotta do 25. I'm sure we can beat that. I'm sure of it. Oops. What the hell? Ah, here it is, right here. There she is. Hey, you actually came. I'm very really sorry for bringing you to such a safe, such dangerous place. I had to. I wouldn't have asked if I really need help desperately. You see, the, you see this place. It used to be a spring here, surrounded by a beautiful pond. It was peaceful, lovely. But then the but then the great battle he, he became so angry and in his rage he took he shook the mountain and his border crashed down, flooded the stream. You can see the results. Oh, well where is my mind? Tell me how Prince Come on, come on. Man. I think I partly the blame the bed and turned that prince of the Take it. See, Prince Cole is very young and was a great guy that's pulled my attention. She was an amazing woman. I was honored to have her as my teacher. She was kind and brave. And I was surprised. And her dealing with the great uh about I'm, I'm, I'm not yet worthy of being mentioned in the same same breath as hers. Her, as well. If only I possess some, possess some of her strength. I'm sure Prince Kumali will have felt more support. Uh, I'm sorry to ask, but I need your help. I want to go to the small shrine that near the peak of the dragon. That ledge over there is so high. If I can get some wind under my wing, Okay. So, there you go. Thank you very much. Thank you so much. Okay, pick me up. Then face the ledge that you can toss me. The atmosphere occurring in our wind was so, so bank plus we touch into the direction of the wind. Alright, I'm ready. Don't hold back now. Hold me as hard as you can. Okay. So like she said, depending on what wind direction is gonna blow, but right now it's gonna it's blowing north. That's where we gotta blow it. Well not blow it. But... You know what? Let's do this. If you okay, I need to see. We can do this. So we had that. <laughs> Will be easy. 
Oh, thank you. <laughs> I think now I'll be able to climb Dragon Group and meet with the great, great level. level. Don't worry, I'll be fine. I may, I may be just an apprentice attendant, but I can't understand some of the great, um, great Vado's language. happened to me is look at the prince company. This is all I have to give you. I know it's, it's, it's not it's not much, but please take it. You're giving me an empty bottle. Nice. And please don't tell anyone that I'm climbing the dragon room. It'll be our secret, okay? Well, good luck. To, the bo to both of us. Oh, that's uninspected. But well, since we got the bottle, uh, we can use it to fill up something up. Uh, bottle. Like for example, we can fill up the water right here. We're pretty much got like, water. Oh, right, we gotta blow this boulder up, which is this rock. So let's climb up. So we can find some bombs out here. Uh, better yet, we just found them. But unfortunately, they're like dead plants. In order to bring them back, we gotta put some water on them. As you can see the results, we got this. The water is going up. swim our way now. Oh, this is something. Now we gotta throw bombs on those pots over there. I kind of messed up. It was... Oh, okay, cool. I was gonna say, like, wait, is it in there? Oh, we can't mess that up. Let's grab this one. Turn. Got it. Yep. All right. Let's go. Ooh, Dragon Rue Cavern. So I'm guessing this is like. The first temple, I presume. Well, kind of, well, let's just say like a dungeon. Um, we can put it like that. They do. I mean, Dragon Root, Dragon Root uh, Cavern, huh? I kind of feel like, um, when I first played this game, to me it's like a fire temple. Because this whole place is full of lava. You know, but it's different. No, no. Dorgondo Cavern. That reminds me of that. Not Fire Temple. Dorgondo's uh, Caverns. That's what this place reminds me of. Something like that. But who knows. But anyway, um, we're pretty much going to uh, end this right now because we're running out of time, as usual. So, we will finish... No. We will do this dungeon next time. Pretty much we're going to do our first dungeon, you know. But yeah, we're going to do it next time. Yes, but I'm giving a good stretch. It's, it is time to go, unfortunately. So, yep, that's it. If you guys enjoy it, hit the like button. If you want to see more of Wind Waker, let's play. Be sure you hit the subscribe. And 
the bell so you can get the navigation. Alright. Thanks for watching. I'll see y'all later.